There it goes. I'm on pound X and I'm going to try and show you how the Martingale bot works. Oh, sounds like it was real. I'm going to try a different one. I'm doing Shiba going a minute on it, which has been quite profitable to be honest. I mean, too bad in where we had that little crash yesterday. So, um, yeah, so I'm on my phone. I'm doing it off my phone to be honest. I was going to do it off the laptop, but I uh, just want to show you full settings on this. So, I'm going to trade at the bottom. Unless it's any different on your phone. Uh, you can see one what I've got set up there, what I did the other day, which is running quite well, and that was during the crash. So I've got a few small ones running all the way down. That one's a bit red, but a couple of pound. And uh, that one's alright. If I show you this one, it's ready to sell at five five to eight. So when it reaches that point it will sell up and uh, we'll sell all these. But, uh, let me show you that again, actually. <clears throat> In fact, I'll show you this one. You know, I want this one. Right, so that's how it buys and sells, you see, on that. So it kind of like doubles up in a way. I mean, depending on how many of these, I'll show you what these are later. Each one of these is, what well, that one on? 2%. Yeah, so each one of them is like a 2% drop. Every time it drops by 2%, it'll rebuy it, it'll buy in again. And it's a Martin Gale, so it kind of like doubles in a way. I don't think it exactly doubles on this, not not 100% sure how the, where the price at, but obviously you won't be able to double it because whatever money you've got in, it has to balance it out on each one. But it, it kind of like, it doubles it in a way, if that makes any kind of sense. So, uh, so yeah, let me uh, go back onto the settings and show you how to uh, set it up. So go on this Martin Girl bot on that. I'm going to go on manual settings. Right, the price scale is how you want it to drop. So I'm doing this one on the CRO uh, USDT. CRO is the uh, crypto.com coin or token, should I say, which is what I like. I'm holding a lot of them at the moment, so it's nice to trade them as well this way. So uh, I've got the price scale on a 2% drop, so every time it drops by 2%, it'll buy for me. So while I'm showing you that, I'll just go down to this bottom bit, you can see it says safety orders. So what that one is, is every time it drops by 2%, it'll buy one of these safety orders. So that what I'm just showing you on the other bit, so I put 5 in, it'll do 5 attempts, so it'll split your money up between those 5 2% drops. And it'll try and double up on each each drop. So you've got five drops. And anyway, so to take profit at one percent. So you've got your two percent drop five times. You'll try to double each time. So if it were exactly doubling, then you'd have your first lot one, and then your second lot to be two, and then four and then 8, and so on, 16, that kind of thing. Don't do it exactly though, because it has to work it out per drop, depending on how much you put in. So, uh, we put all the investment on that, 99, which I've just put across. So yeah, so I've got 2% drop, 1% profit, and 5 orders in. So, yep, let's set that one up, and I can show you what it looks like when it's set it up. Check how that's right. Two percent drop. Five. Yep. Right. So that's set up now. So I'll show you details on it. <coughs> so if you look, one, two, three, four. That's your five drops. Well, the greens is your drops. It's already. It's already bought in one. As you can see there, about. Just under seven dollars worth is bought on that one. Um, so what it'll do now is it'll split the rest of the money up between these and try to double up each time as you can see. That's why the balls get bigger. So you can see the prices there. So it'll sell the first lot if it goes up to that sell order, which is three, four, seven, two. If it carries on dropping down, then it'll buy in again. 
at that price, 3366, and then it'll double up again. So it'll buy more each time. So if you look at the amounts what it's buying, it's buying 20 on that one. It's bought, I think it's bought 20 on this one, to be honest. It's a ship holdings 20. I think that's how it works. I think it's holding 20 at the moment. It'll buy 20 on that. And then the next one down will be 30, then 48, then 74, then 113. And it balances. So if it bought all the lot all the way down, you'd have an average price for your tokens. Um, and that's how you can make your money. And then from the average price, as it goes back up again, once you've made a 2% profit, it'll sell them all. Then it'll reboot and start all over again. And just carry on going until you stop it. So, uh, so yeah, that's that one set up. So, yeah, so we'll leave that running and see how that one goes. And then, uh, might put a little update up on that.